Hello, I'm James George, and this is Web Design Blog. And this week, I'm going to talk about AppSumo and their uh, Sumo Me plugins. I've uh, been a subscriber of AppSumo for a while, and they have various things on there, such as how to uh, do this and how to do that, and how to gain uh, subscribers and followers, and and they have a lot of great tips on there. But something that they've come out with recently is the Sumo Me uh, plugin suite that uh, has sort of an all inclusive uh, system set up with it. And so, what you can do with it is you can create, uh, like at the top here, this notification bar, which can promote people to subscribe to your website. It also has uh, this little popover thing for uh, sharing images on your site and it also has a pop-up form that is highly optimized it's very interesting how they they've set this up and I just wanted to walk you through this and show you how setting this up uh, works it's, it's super easy and if you're looking for uh, this type of a solution for your website this could be very easy so if you go to www.appsumo.com, you can find uh, List Builder and uh, different things. They have different posts on here, but you you want to look for their List Builder or one of their plugins, and everything integrates together because once you uh, click on the Get This or Download button or whatever, once you download one, it uh, you install it on your WordPress site, and you'll have this little widget. Now, this is only visible to you. And you're able to go in and make settings on uh, your different products. And so I wanted to try this with uh, my, one of my newer sites called Web Design Fanatic. And if you click the crown, it opens up and shows you everything that you have installed. It has a Sumo store, which is where you uh, get all these little widgets and things. And it has your settings. And so if you go into store, it will show you a list of things that you can download for free. Now, nothing here is uh, paid except for the leads one, but there are paid options inside of these that you can activate if you want customized uh, layouts or options or features or something like that. But uh, a lot of the standard stuff is great, especially for the uh, bar at the top, the uh, smart bar. And so, if you go back to the crown here, you have these different uh, plugins. For example, List Builder is extremely easy. Uh, it integrates well with your website and it lets you create a pop up exactly how you want to create it. And so you can create the design and it, you can control the behavior, you can control the colors. I created the I integrated the custom purple from my site into the pop-up so that it looks like it belongs with my website like it's supposed to. Uh, the font color, the text color, uh, the button background, everything. Uh, you can uh, customize all of it. You can also customize the behavior. I set it to smart or you can set it to manual and set how what, you know how they trigger the pop-up. Uh, you can set a success URL and so I have a thank you page where you can follow me on Twitter and Facebook and you know I thank you for connecting with me and all that stuff. Um, you can set the frequency uh, whether it shows up on all devices. You have complete control over everything. Uh, you can connect it with MailChimp Aweber, Constant Contact, Campaign Monitor, and Get Response. Uh, I use MailChimp and it took two seconds. When I clicked, uh, it asked me for my username for MailChimp and then it asked me what list I wanted. It, it took me two seconds. You can even uh, set up advanced forms if you want to, but if you use one of these services, you can literally set up this pop-up form in seconds. On my other sites, I use um, pop-up domination. It takes a lot longer to set up and 
uh, it's not as easy to customize as as this one. I was I was pleasantly surprised at how easy this was to set up. Another example in this suite is called Image Share, and let's go ahead and. I don't know if there are any options. Yeah, there's not really many options. Uh, use a URL shortener, uh, include the image alt text, and your Twitter username. That's pretty much it. And what it does is it overlays a Twitter, Facebook, and a Pinterest icon. And so if somebody wants to share your image, they don't have to find a pin it button or you know, go up to their toolbar or whatever. When they hover over the image, they're like, wow, I could just click this and it opens up Pinterest and they can share it to their Pinterest account in a matter of seconds. And Smart Bar is easy to set up too. So you just go here and you can set up the appearance, what it says, um, you know, all the text, the button, what it says. How it behaves, if it shows always, or if it stays at the top, or if it scrolls. You can customize the colors of everything, the background, the form, the text, the button, the background, all of it. Uh, and you can also integrate your email services. You know, I have MailChimp connected. It's all said and done. It took a matter of two seconds to set this whole system up and so you know in a matter of minutes you could have all of these items installed on your website set up and you're ready to go and this is a fantastic little suite and uh, everything is free and if you want uh, some of the custom pop-up templates for the email uh, the, the pop-up form then I think it's like maybe 10 bucks for that. And if uh, you want customized designs, I think they're well worth it. You know, it, it, how fast this loads and how easy this is to set up, I think it's worth 10 bucks. Uh, but they don't ask you for anything. You can use it as it is for free. And so I suggest that you go to appsumo.com and check out those plugins. Well, that's it for this week. I'm James George, and this is Web Design Blog.